You guys ready to fuck? I'm ready to fuck. Okay. Put it in. This is where you say your bit. Wow. The RCM sent us some big dick cops. Real big dick cops. Look at them. Reckless. Swinging in the wind. Yeah, look at the big dick on that cop. Can't tell a dick that big what to do. Must be something in the water in Jamrock. Yeah, gave them real nice big dicks. Yeah, um, anyways. You like sunglasses, officer? I've got the latest styles right here. Don't be shy. These are premium class clothes. Good quality fabrics, best retro design. Save the economy with your style, officer. I can see you have a taste for luxury, officer. Can't keep your eyes off those sneakers? Bastards! We have a right to work! Pull up and stay frosty, everyone. Cops are here! Here to fuck with us? Beat the honest worker down? We're here to fight for a cause. Stripes usually have problems with people who have causes. Good, we're fighting for a cause here. Right to work, right to work. Besides, we're not that different. It helps the people see us talking. Cops and strike breakers together. Shows authorities are on our side. Builds confidence. Good to see you, friend. Do I have deals set up for you, buddy boy? So what do you want? I got smokes. They're cheap. Very cheap. I got Pilsner. Great deal. You won't get a better deal on that piss. Spirits I can let go for 300 real. Also, I have speed. And by speed, I mean amphetamine. That's one brutal motor carriage. If I were a real skull right now, I'd jack it, paint it in palm tree livery, then bottom light it neon style. Snazzy shit ripped skull mobile like this would make a fine trophy. We could like hang fucking shrunken heads from the side mirrors. Cops heads, scary tribal shit. Yeah, tribal shit. A cop carriage like this would have proper skull value. While I appreciate the interest you take in my brutal motor carriage, I have to stop you right there. The RCM. I, um, it's just theoretical work, copper. No basis in reality. Man, if we were certified skulls right now. I can tell you who were not cop. We're not snitches or skulls. Which is not to say that the skulls are bitches in On the contrary. The part of the presentation you want to take home with you, cop man, is we're not part of the skulls yet. Not looking for any trouble, officer. There's no trouble. I'm just speaking in a lowered voice. I don't want to be seen talking to the gendarmerie, if that's okay. I just want to finish my cigarette. Is it really that important? Thank you.
All right, but make it quick. Once I finish this cigarette, I have to run. Gendarmerie, you found me. It was mine. My friends use it from time to time to visit me. So tell me, are you here to make things right again? Beautiful. I have some good news for you. My Sunday friend is visiting me tonight. I told him about you, and he'd like to say hello. Step in. He's already waiting. I'm all out of shit to give, Loincloth. Welcome to the fucking reckoning. Put your goddamn gun down. People are gonna get hurt. We need to talk this through, all right? Shut up! You're not gonna talk yourself out of this, Loincloth shit fuck. This is a misunderstanding. Nothing irreversible has happened yet. You can just return to your unit and forget all about this. The Kipt is merciful, willing to spare us if we just forget about our murdered and humiliated commander. I think we should just kill everyone caught here. You all drunk, come to your senses. You won't gun down seven people in the middle of the street. This isn't a frontier town, or a jungle outpost. Easy, Lizzie. Let me handle it. I know guys like this. I'm sure we can come to a peaceful agreement. Ain't that right, fella? Peaceful? Nest in your abdominal cavity like a little wild mouse! Fuck, there's the third one. How did we miss something like this? If this turns into a firefight, we should take him out first. My plan is not to get killed, but we have to intervene. Get lost, comedian! You cops had your chance! Now it's fucking time for some justice! Big fuck! Crazy motherfucker. Didn't think you had that fury in you, but I guess I've misjudged a lot of people lately. That was one hell of a shot. Hell of a shot. The fucks did not expect that. I guess what I'm trying to say here is thank you for intervening, fellas. That was mighty brave of you. <laughs> 